So it keeps dropping even though the sun's up. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. I think it turns around about 8, eight or 9. I'm not sure what when it starts heating back up. It can potentially handle 4,000 watts. Those are 2,000 watt uh, elements. And I've got two of them in there, so. But I've only got 2,000 watts. I think that's going to be plenty. I really do. After watching the, the performance of everything. It's 2.30 in the morning. 27.56 inside the crock pot inside the worm house with the 100 watt uh, element plate I made. So that's done good. Okay, it's 34 degrees outside. So it was 57. Fifty-seven Celsius inside, thirty-four degrees outside, no insulation. One thousand to one thousand and twenty watts. So it's performing the way I want it to, as far as I can tell. That's the temperature inside the sand battery inside the worm bin. But it's up off the dirt. It's a small little tub. The, the actual temperature of the air in there is about 75. We have rain for a few days. It's November 25th, Monday, 8.30 in the morning. So our plan is I got to add the other 1,000 watts. I know I have this already recorded, but uh, I've started here. I'll get this done in the next few days. And then I'll just add four, pan four uh, solar panels at a time and monitor it but i will get all uh 12 of them up so i'll put two here and then uh, 10 back here and then once i get the 2000 watts if it's still not performing how i think it needs to prior to insulating it i'll remove some sand and until i'm happy with this because i've seen it perform with a thousand watts on one of these elements to where it was just really kicking. So it's a balance thing and I just got to get it figured out. In a previous video, I had this one. Now I got away from the galvanized because of the fumes. But this thing was kicking with a thousand watts and you could feel the heat all around it. Now, of course, it's a lot less mass, but there is a balance and I'm going to figure it out.